Now each mode has a bunch of moves that all fit together. So split time, same direction has the weaves and the windmill and water mill and all of that. And they all can, you know, inter interweave with each other. There's also, that's one kind of transition. There's also the transitions you make between the modes. So when you go from split, all the split time, same direction moves and you switch to opposites and you're playing opposites for a little while and then you might switch to your reels, all the same time moves. Often what you know, point spinners do is going from one to the other is you do a reverse. So you stall and reverse a poi to make that transition. It would take a lot of videos to show you every possible way to make transitions. Uh, there's just so many because there's so many moves and any move can link to many other moves. What I can say, if you can learn to stall right, stall left, stall right, stall left in several basic positions, you're going to be giving yourself the basic skills you need to make transitions between your modes. And that is quite actually quite simple. So you can start, to, the positions are this. At your, at your side planes, mm -hmm. um, you can start same time, stall the right, stall the left, stall the right, stall the left, back where you started. The next one would be on a wall plane in front of you, stall the right, stall the left, stall the right, stall the left, and you're back where you started. Uh, next one getting a bit more difficult is going to be with your arms crossed, and this is getting more tricky, so you know it's something you might come back to a few times. Stall the right, stall the left, stall the right, stall the left. You're back where you started, and then ultimately on a wall plane behind you. Stall the right, stall the left, stall the right, stall the left. Although that's getting kind of advanced, so that's something you can think of. It's going to take weeks or months, or you know, quite a while before you really have mastered that. But uh, definitely. If you want to feel like you're really comfortable with the basics, at least be able to do that very comfortably at your sides and on a wall plane in front of you. And every time you make a, a stall in reverse, you can choose. Um, because if I stall the right, I'm going to go from same direction into opposites. It's up to me the, whether I come into same time opposites or split time opposites. And then when I reverse the right, it's up to me whether I'm going to be in same time backwards or split time backwards. And I just uh, invite you to keep shaking that up so that you know, maybe you're going from a wall plane in front of you, inwards, opposite, same time. And at first you go stall in the same time, same direction. Stall, opposites, stall, same time. But then also try split time opposites into split time, same direction. Split time opposites. Which one? In the split time, same direction. Uh, or from same time opposites in the split time, same direction. In the same time opposites into split. Or you can go same time opposites, split time, same direction. Split time opposites, split time, same direction. Right, back to where you started. Um, and in the beginning, the, the important, you know, the ones you should start with are at your sides, wall plane in front of you. In time, you want to play with this at your, uh, with your arms crossed and on a wall plane behind you. And then you can move on in the end to playing where you're dancing freely and you just keep going stall the right, right reverse the left, reverse the right, reverse the left, reverse the right, reverse the left. And just no matter what you're doing, Force yourself to reverse one and then the other and see how it takes you in and out of all the modes. And it's a, it's a lot of fun. And that's where you can also say to yourself, uh, you're going to start saying opposites and you're going to go opposites, stall the right, uh, split time, same direction, stall the left, split him opposites, stall the right, and your reels, stall the left back where you started. Uh, and that's going to take you a long way in learning how to dance freely and improv with your boy.